video is brought to you by G2A.com for cheap games, MSP, and PSN codes. And sponsored by FatalGrips.com. Use the code BUCKS to get 10% off controller grips, cases, and much, much more. Hey guys, how's it going? Master Bucks here. Welcome to another episode of the 2025 Crew Mode Series. And today, we're looking at another one of the players, another German player with a brilliant, brilliant future ahead of them, surely. It is Leon Gortska. Gortska has been a player in career mode for a very, very long time where he's definitely been a sensational pickup. Sometimes he's been one of those lower, lower overall players with a very high potential. He's always had a high potential in every single FIFA career mode, dating way back to FIFA 12, FIFA 13. He's been superb. But now he's got an overall of around 76 and the technical attributes are absolutely mental. This guy is so well-rounded and so, so brilliant. I mean, you know I am an absolute sucker for players that are totally well-rounded with their stats, and this guy is the absolute pinnacle. Gortzka has an overall in-game in FIFA 16 of 76 and a potential of 85, which means I'm looking at every one of the stats that he has and envisioning it plus 10 at least, and losing my freaking mind at all the greens that this player would have. He could very well become the ultimate all-rounder, and I would absolutely be frothing at the mouth if it happened, and my goodness do I want it to happen. Let's take a look at this man's stats in depth. So here we are, Leon Gortzka, and immediately looking at the mental and physical, you can see what I'm getting at. Only 67. Jumping and strength, the lowest stats that he has. Everything else is around that 70 mark. And then the skill attributes. The penalties at 51 are the absolute standout worst stat that he has, of course, apart from his goalkeeping, because everything else is so brilliant around that 70 rating, uh, that 70 mark. It's incredible. Can play at center mid, right mid, and center defensive mid, although I've definitely heard some rumors that he's very good at center attacking mid as well. Four star weak foot and skill moves. He's got no specialities, but he definitely has that flair trade as well. And my goodness, we need to see if this man can do it. Never have I wanted a player to just absolutely supersede their potential so badly. Like, I'm talking 90s. I want to see this guy as an absolute tank. And immediately in his first season, we don't really get the growth that we would have hoped. We get plus one in his first. Good form, good morale. That's an okay start. But the only growth we've gotten is to the mental, or at least from what's being indicated. And I'm just telling you, look at him in the squad report. It's unbelievable. There's only one freaking stat that's below 60. Are you kidding me? That's ridiculous. And, this, and he's only 76 rated, now 77 rated. I mean, he's not even Paul Pogba. But he's, he doesn't have like that 84, 86 rating that Paul Pogba has. And he's only got one stat below 60. I'm, I'm, I'm losing it. Bloody hell, I'm just too excited right now. I need to calm down. But anyway, here we are in the second season. How has Gortzka gone about it this time? Any more than a plus one increase? It's just going to once again be a plus one increase. But this time at least, he's got a couple of attributes that have gone up all spread around all over the place, both to his physical, mental, and technical. You see a lot of technical attribute growth as per usual, but this time we get a little bit of increase to his ball control, his free kick accuracy, his curve, and a few others here and there. But sadly, it's not really the growth that we would have wanted. We want every stat to go up by at least one or two. We definitely want that overall growth to be a bit higher per season. But anyway, he's 22 and 78. He has to climb by seven in his overall in the eight remaining seasons that we have until we get to 2025. He needs a big, big burst, a big kick up the ass. We can't get it for him this time, unfortunately. He's just going up once again, back to back to back, plus one increases to his overall, which is fine. And again, better than nothing. His mental attributes are now insane. They're all above 80, which is crazy, especially that vision, which is great to see. But there are definitely other stats we really would have wanted to see go up a little bit better. I've, I'm yet to see penalties be indicated to be increased. And yet I can tell because we've already noted that they were 51. They're now at 53. There may be some other stats that have been going up that we haven't been told have been increased. So knowing that, I feel pretty po I feel pretty confident. But now we go ahead to skip seven seasons to go all the way to 2025, and I am so pumped and excited. I really hope he kills it, but let's have a look. Let's go all the way to 2025. So here we are, 2025 with Leon Gortzka, one of the players I've been waiting a long time to do a 2025 Grimo video with, and finally it's happened. Has he got to his potential? Has he gone over it? What's his rating in 2025? It's a whopping 86, one over his potential, which is great to see, but the technical attributes, guys, we finally got to see them. So many greens, so many dark greens as well, so many stats around the 90 or just under the 90, it's incredible how brilliantly he has gone about with his technical attributes at 86 and 30 years of age. So many brilliant passing stats as well as his shooting stats, curve, ball control and dribbling, and some of the physical attributes have not gone up that much, but still, the technical attributes have been so well, so well increased, and 
his and his mental attributes as well to all still be above 80 at 30 years of age. It's just brilliant. He's so, so good. Leon Gortska, just one of the number of players that I absolutely have to consider getting in a career mode at some point. I'm an absolute sucker. I say this all the time whenever it comes up. A total sucker for super well-rounded and all-rounded players, and he is one of the best. It's incredible. Well, thank you for watching another 2025 video, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And of course, leave in the comments down below what players you would want me to do next. And until the next time, guys, my name is Master Bucks, and have a good one. Bye-bye.